the Parker Solar Probe. That's so it was heavily armored, I guess, to su survive the heat. Shielded, but you know, you know, you don't need a lot of solar panels. Just a little bit is enough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it got really 6.1 million kilometers. Got really close. Uh, mm -hmm. This was and the was 22nd a, time it actually made a close uh, approach. But this was, was the moving at 190 yet. kilometers a second, which that uh, makes it the fastest human made object ever yeah that's moving it's weird to think in terms of getting closer to the sun means going really really fast but that's what happens well but if you've ever put your hand in a flame <laughs> you realize speed is of the essence isn't it yeah you, just, you don't want to spend a lot of time there in that hot environment yeah well and it's that it's not just that it's just that the gravitational effects are so easy to make it accelerates it excessively so yeah so they have to uh i would imagine they're kind of glancing off of yeah. They're skimming through the corona yeah of the sun to take and hoping they have enough speed not to get trapped. Well, they definitely do. It's actually really hard to be able to slow down enough to actually impact the sun. And that whole trope of just throw it into the sun turns out really difficult thing to do. You can't. Uh, yeah, you couldn't. You couldn't get your speed right enough to actually get in there. You'll just get slingshot around and thrown back out. Even if you aim right at the middle, yeah, it's just not that easy to aim at the middle. You've got to really. <laughs> Okay. Burn a lot of, of Delta V to do that. So, 